Hey guys, good morning. Today we've got another test of the EcoFlow Delta Max. Um, we've got some carts back from a festival. It rained heavily this weekend here in Florida and the carts are just destroyed. They're nasty, muddy. So usually I clean them on the driveway, um, but I don't want all this stuff. I'll have to clean the driveway after I get done cleaning the carts. So. I thought, hey, you know, we'll use the, the Delta Max, put it down here on the, the concrete pad um, where the trailers and everything sit and uh, use the pressure washer off of it and see what happens. Um, hopefully it'll work it. Um, the pressure washer and the maximum output of the Delta Max is about the same. Now, um, it's a Ryobi 1600 PSI. Um, it just says on the, on the label, it says maximum continuous output, 15 amps. So that doesn't mean it'll do it all the time so we're gonna see this is either gonna be a really quick video because it won't work and I have to put everything back and go back to the house or we're gonna get some cool footage and uh, clean the carts in the meantime and uh, get some uh, more data as to how the uh, EcoFlow Delta Max works um, under different conditions so with that let me uh, kind of show you what we're working with um, like I said we have three carts two six-seaters and a four-seater um, that's all we had available for them to use this weekend um, but uh, I'll kind of give you a walkthrough of the state of them. So this is the white one. You can tell there's dirt, mud all over the carts. Up under there, the wheel wells are trashed. The floor is nasty, the seats are nasty. front floor you know the dash the dash in the front seat are pretty good because that's where the people were um, well, there's the, the front end this one's a little worse it's got mud splattered everywhere up in the wheel wells I don't know if you can make that out <clears throat> and actually it rained last night the the wheels here have actually cleaned off some there's the floor on the front of this one, cubbies. It's mainly the undercarriage. Uh, here's the six seater. It's really bad. There's the floor and the front wheels. Now I imagine the underside of these is really bad. I haven't even looked at the seat yet. This is what usually happens when it comes back from the the festivals it's just uh, it's just a layer of dirt or dust but like i said it rained heavily and just completely muffed everything up there's the <laughs> that's a good one and they put down hay and straw to try to help people where they were walking so there's hay and straw everywhere and there's the other side Floor there, floor there again. Front wheel on this one. All right, so that's the cart condition, and here's our setup right now. I've got here's our setup right now. I've got the garden hose. We've got water over there by the solar panel. So I've got the garden hose running into the Roby. Again, this is an old 1600 psi one that I've had for a long time. It was a good deal. Actually, I bought it uh, refurbished from Home Depot for like. 49 bucks it's like <laughs> it's gonna work for us and then we have the uh, delta max right over there uh, away from the water hopefully and we've got our hose connected up to our wand i also have a, a short wand i don't know if i want to get too close to these things right now so we'll try the long one and if not i'll this is one i usually use to clean them So I'll set you guys up on a time lapse, I guess, and uh, we'll I'm gonna power this thing up here in just a second. I guess I'll do that right now. Let's just see if it even works. So we're going to. It's already on. It's charging another camera. So we're at 88%, and we're gonna hit.
hit the power button here. All right, it did power up. So let's see what happens when we pull the trigger. Continuous, so that's good. Seems like it's gonna work, so I'll set you guys up on a time lapse and uh, either on the unit or on me, one of the two. I ain't figured it out. I only have one camera charged up, so we'll be back. All right, so I'm like halfway done. Um, when I have the trigger pulled on the Delta II Max, um, it shows about, right now it shows about 44 minutes remaining. <clears throat> so I didn't check it when I first started, so I can't give you an accurate description of what, what it's used totally. But man, I'm telling you, it's like, this is the, this is the, this is the knit right here. It's pretty cool. It, it actually will run a freaking electric pressure washer, 1600 PSI electric pressure washer and run it well. Hasn't I, I've done, I've done the entire side, front, and underbelly of two carts, and I've done the whole the big blue six seater is in front of me here, and it, it didn't even fart, didn't cut out once, nothing. It's fantastic. I mean, it's the more you have these things, the longer you have these things, the more uses you find for them. It's crazy. We've done all kinds of crap with this, with these Delta twos and Delta two maxes. We got. You know we've run we've run crock pots we've run we've charged carts uh now we're running pressure washers you know we run lights with them for christmas time you know on some of the carts and displays and stuff like that it's it's just amazing the the utility in them and how how useful they are once you get one you know, you, you get it and you're like oh, i'm gonna use it for you know hurricane or, or whatever your natural disaster is in your area if you know we're, power charging phone stuff like that and then then you just start using it for whatever else you know if you think about it all right so that's it i'm done clean three carts in the trailer and i had to go back and do several spots on each cart a couple times i feel bad i didn't look at my clock i know i was out here before eight setting up so it is now 916 and I just got done um, so I would say conservatively it's been running pretty much straight for an hour um, you know when I was running the pressure washer it's not like I'm like on off on off I mean it's been on basically you know with very few offs just to you know undo the core the hose or or move to the other side or stuff like that. It has been constant. And the uh, the Delta II Max has been freaking phenomenal. That is like crazy. That's nuts. And it's not hot. I mean, it's like, it, it is completely cool. And obviously I can't hear if the fans are running because the pressure washer is right next to it. But I mean, it's a little warm right here on the vents. I'm assuming where the fans have been running, but the rest of it is cool as a cucumber. The top's cool, and it's been charging the camera the whole time. Um, I did have one shut off just about 10 minutes ago, 15 minutes ago. Um, I was pressure washing this side, and it just shut off. But thats I don't think that was a Delta II Max. That pressure washer, I've been having problems with it. It is it's going on like 10 years old i think and uh, the past month or so i'll be pressure washing and using it and it'll just boom it'll just shut off and then you know you'll you'll let go re-trigger pull it and it'll come right back on so i'm gonna blame that on the pressure washer because i know it does it and it's been doing it for several months now um but like i said it went off i did the same thing i do when it's plugged in the house i let go pull the trigger again and power right it went right back on so i don't it wasn't the delta because i literally had, two minutes before i'd looked at the screen when i had the trigger pulled and it still said like 33 minutes of continuous you know runtime so 
The only thing I might do right now is do a, a trigger pull and put the camera right on the screen so you can kind of see, you know, what it does. Um, and I might put that on the beginning of the video if I don't have one already. Um, All right, here's a trigger pull. Hopefully it comes out. If not... So we're doing 1,730 watts. So it has 1739 watts, it says 47%, 33 minutes left. All right, we're back. So <clears throat> the screen says we were pulling 1739 watts, 1739. And at the end of the, when I was, at the end, when I was done, said it had 30 minutes left, 33 minutes left, something like that. And we're at 47%. We started at 88%, I think it's what it was. I'll throw it on the screen if I'm incorrect, but 80 something. So yeah, I mean, we've been working like a little over an hour, probably like an hour and 15 minutes. Um, pressure wash three carts completely, a trailer, and then redid the carts briefly again. Um, I had to go in the battery compartment of the white one because I forgot that. But yeah, um, I can't say enough good things about this thing. Like I said earlier, the more I, the longer I have it, the more uses I find for it. And I would assume that's going to be probably most people. Um, you know, we have water out here at where the parking pad is here. Um, this is where I store the truck the trailer, the other trailer, the boat. Um, there's another trailer that sits back here. Um, there's water just right there um, for me to like hose the boat off and run the motors and stuff like that. So there's water out here, but there's no power. And the closest power is hundreds of feet that way. Um, so yeah, it was just kind of a fluke thing. I was talking to the wife last night. I'm like, hey, you know, maybe I'll take the Delta Max out there and see if it'll run the pressure washer. And it will. By golly, it will. So if you've got like a remote place and you want to run a pressure washer like like this is a ryobi 1600 psi it's an old one and it says on the on here and it says on here i don't know if you can read it maximum current 13 amps right there and the output for and the output for the Delta Max is 15, I think continuous. But yeah, I can't, that's that's cool. I mean, that's neat. Um, and we're only down to 47%. So I'll go back in and charge it up and it'll be good to go for next time. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. I thought it was a neat experiment. Um, I'll probably do some more of these depending on what I got going on uh, to see if we can run these. Um, in the future but yeah that uh, kind of gives you an idea if you have any questions or comments or concerns please put them in the comments below if, uh, i'll try to answer your questions if i didn't cover anything cover something enough but uh thanks for watching and have a good day i get to go clean these again because this is just round one then i really have to use soap and water we'll see you in the next one